Hello and welcome to part 6 of my Halo Combat Evolved walkthrough. I am still on the Ringworld Halo and I'm seeking out stranded marines to help them fight the Covenant. There's one batch of stranded marines that I've yet to find and I think they're this way. So let's get down to some Covenant booty kicking action. Some Covenant there. Let's get out and uh, do some damage. I've got a sniper rifle. Nice. And if you remember, I'm playing in the Anniversary Edition, so I have the ability to switch between the old school Xbox graphics and these current gen graphics. So let's find these stranded marines and help them out. Let's get on foot and do some damage on foot. Jackals. Where is he? The elites in this have great AI. They don't just stand in front of you and wait to get shot. They kind of dodge, dark, they hide. When their shields are down, they Let's run away so that their shields can recharge. Pretty damn good, really. But if I remember correctly, I think the Marines are around here somewhere. But I think I've got to clear up all these Covenant in order for the Marines to appear. So let's do that. You gotta love the grunts. Always panicking, always screeching in that weird squealy grunt voice. And look at my men poised, ready for action. Great game. Let's see where these remaining covenant are. I think they're up here. Have some of that. Down. I think my favourite weapon in Combat Evolved has got to be either the pistol or the sniper rifle. And have you seen the sniper rifle for Halo 4? Um, it looks vastly different to the sniper rifle that, uh, of Combat Evolved. It's, it, it's, someone's described it as looking like a tank and it's huge. It, it has to set, there we go, there's my marines. But back to the Halo 4 sniper rifle. Um, still has four clips, uh, four rounds per, per clip. It still has a two times scope, but it looks vastly different. Can't wait to try it out. Still a few more Covenant to take down. I think they should be over here somewhere according to the radar on the bottom left. There we go. I think there may be some in here. There we go. Done. Covenant wiped out, Marines saved. I found Captain Keys. Good job. He's being held on a Covenant cruiser, the Truth and Reconciliation, a ship I disabled before we abandoned the auto. Check out the uh, stunning vistas here. Absolutely beautiful. Let's see what they look like in the old school graphics. Still pretty cool. And there's carrier that will take all these saved marines to somewhere a little safer. Um, what would happen if I shot him in the head? Shall I give it a little try? There's our ride. He's get lucky, run away. Let's see if I can pick him off. That was cruel. That was cruel. I admit. There we go. 
So that's Halo completed. Uh, and with the cutscenes in the anniversary edition as well, if you are already in the old school graphics, you get to see the cutscene in the old school graphics as well. But unfortunately, you can't flip back and forth within the cutscenes between the old school and the current gen. So if you're already in the old school graphics, you have to see the entire cutscene in the old school graphics. But that's Halo done and completed. And now on to the third level, uh, the truth and reconciliation uh, where I get to board a Covenant ship in an attempt to rescue Captain Keys. So again, it's going to be a lot more corridor shooting, um, basically more Covenant, uh, more elites, more grunts, more jackals, and fighting my way through corridors in order to get to get to uh, Captain Keys. Actually, before before that section, there's a nice little sniping at night section which is about to play out now. And this is this I think this level's. Uh, a lot of favorite, a lot of people's favorite level as well. So, and uh, I used to love doing this level because you start off with a sniper rifle. So, uh, if you're a sniper fan, this is a great level. Let's change back to current gen graphics. There we go. It's a lot more detail. But there's a way to clear this section without being spotted if you kind of sneak behind the rocks here and you're careful you can kind of take out most of these covenant without being spotted which is what I'll try and do been spotted but it's still possible to pick off a lot of these Covenant with a sniper rifle bad sniping there three shots and I couldn't get him This is on normal difficulty, um, I've done that for a reason so that it's not too hard for me to complete and I can uh, get through that entire game before November the 6th uh, when Halo 4 comes out and I um, can't wait for that, let's see what a grenade does here. Right over the edge, goodbye! Look at that moon though, brilliant, beautiful graphics. And that's where Captain Keys is, in that huge Covenant spaceship up in the sky. And that's where we're going. As you can see, the current gen graphics far more detailed than the um, original old school Xbox graphics. Let's see if I can take this Elite out. And I died. Well, perfect time to end the video. Um, join me again in part 7 uh, and hopefully I'll be able to get to Captain Keys. Thank you very much for watching and uh, please remember to subscribe, like and comment. Thank you very much.